I'm Katadia. And I'm Max. This is your Daily Diggins for Tuesday, April 5th, 2016. Coming up on today's show, we'll take a sneak peek behind the scenes of our very own Diggins. Attention all freshmen, we are having a class of 2019 movie night here at NU on Thursday, April 7th from 6 to 8 p.m. We will be showing The Goonies. Popcorn, pizza, and soda will be available for purchase. Bring a chair, blanket, and or beanbag. Come hang out with your fellow freshmen. If you haven't been to the library in a while, it's time to check it out. All right, Miners, we've got some good stuff today. Mrs. Hesbeck is back with us here today, so that makes us super happy, doesn't it? it does. Welcome back. It feels good to be back. Thank you. It took a little longer than most people. But here we are, and we have a wonderful annual mm. event that we unload on our students every year. It is so exciting because people can come in, and you can take this little slip of paper, and this little pen, and this little pen, and you write your name, where you're going, and it doesn't have to be, it, it, it doesn't, doesn't matter if it's college, it, it matters that you are planning on something for next year, whether it's vocational ed, whether it's um, just working, we want to know what you're up to, if you're going to take a gap year, we want to know if you're going to school, um, and what your major might be, and on the back, if you could write your contact information, your cell phone, and your email, your home email, we will create a database of all the alum, and not just ask you for money when you're rich, but <laughs> we will keep in touch with you and let you know what's going on with NU. And you know, I, I love to see this every year because, it's, well, last year was the first year, but to watch it fill up for all the seniors coming in at different times of the day, it's so and fun. Putting their little pin in, in most unusual places sometimes, too. I mean, and, and it so wasn't all California, but it was a lot to do with California. But like all over the world and all over the country. And so people have some very difficult conversations about where they're uh, very difficult decisions. Yeah. Not naming any names, but you know who you are. Anyhow, we're excited about this, so please come in and fill it out as soon as you possibly can. And there's more news to come. It's just we can't cram it all into one session, but we're getting near the end of the year, folks. Ten weeks. Really? And we can help you do anything. We can help you win, help you with those A's. We totally can. We're instructional support. I want you to know that. We'd love to help. All right, so please come and see us, and um, see you in the library. Oh, my nice, thanks. <laughs> thanks, ladies. Ultimate Frisbee. It's time for Big Hux and Killer D. The Ultimate Frisbee Club will be meeting Thursday, April 7th to prepare for the upcoming tournament and to adopt our <laughs> constitution. New players are welcome, and remember, we play every Friday at lunch on the turf. See you soon. The spring weather sure is kicking in. Let's see how that's been affecting our sports with our sports report. What's up, Miners? I'm Brandon Sterling here with your beginning of the week sports report. Let's kick it off with some varsity baseball. Our varsity baseball team had a game last week in which Andrew Snitches hit a walk-off single driving in two runs. They will be playing Deloro, or they played Deloro yesterday, so we will have those results for you tomorrow. Hopefully it was a good game. Our golf team had their first league tournament yesterday, so we'll have those results for you tomorrow as well. Our volleyball team had a game last week against Oak Ridge in which they lost 3-1, three, three games to one, and they will be looking to bounce back against Pleasant Valley in Chico. This has been your beginning of the week sports report. I'm Brandon Sterling, and we'll see you guys in the next show. Thank you. Nevada Union Men's Basketball Program is hosting its annual three-on-three -three tournament on Saturday, April 9th. Join us for hoops, food, and prizes to support the Nevada Union Men's Basketball Program. Ages third grade to adult, please contact Jeff Dallas at the link on your screen. The University of Idaho will be visiting the Nevada Union tomorrow at 12.30, so please report to conference room number two across from the nurse's office at 12.30 on Wednesday. Ever wonder what it takes to put together our NU news? Time to check out behind the scenes of the daily diggings. What's it like being behind the camera? Well, we're in front of it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.
How was the news made from your side? With a camera. <laughs> well, we get to class and then we change into our NU shirts and then we kind of wait for everyone else to prepare like the camera and the computer. And then once that's all set, we just start kind of filming and getting into the news feel. What's it like being in front of the camera? Uh, it's not really that like terrifying as people might seem. I mean, if you can't read, then it, it'll it'll probably be a problem. But reading's important. How many takes on average does it take to get it right? One. We're perfect. Seven. Eight. Then. <laughs> <laughs> Closer to twelve. <laughs> What do you think about how the news is evolving? I like it. I like it a lot. I think the news is evolving very rapidly, kind of like technology. I like it. It was a lo It's a lot better now than it was last year. Yeah, I think it's really improving with all of the new effects that we have on and short of the script, we got rid of verbally saying all the stuff we sell at school, which produces time and that's good. Yeah, we've gotten into a good routine this year with it. We're evolving with technology. Like, here's an Apple, and here's us. We're right behind them. Like, and Apple's they're... right here, and we're almost, like, right there. But we're here. <laughs> Basically, we're going to make it big, baby. Thanks, guys. Finally, be a part of the Daily Dance. If you have anything you want featured on the news, like clubs, sports, senior projects, events, or anything else, please submit your videos, ideas, or photos to the email on your screen. You can send at least a week in advance of the set date to ensure your place and it gets on time. That was your Daily Diggins. I'm Max. I'm Cassidia. Have a great day, miners.